three down, on to game number four. Welcome back to EA Sports Playoff coverage. I'm James Sabolski along with Ray Ferraro. Here we go, game four. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere, we're underway. Tosses it on to Oshie. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. A little burst of speed now as the puck's moved inside the offensive zone. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. Ovechkin's teammates love setting him up for a one-time blast. His 1T zone ability really makes him an offensive threat. Dreisaitl's known for his accurate passing plays. That's his tape-to-tape -tape zone ability, guys, and it's what makes him effective at distributing the puck. I'm expecting one of these star players to push their team tonight. James, over to you. Bouchard's moving the puck through his own zone. Taken by Nurse. And now it's over to Dreisaitl. And he takes a shot. And a great save. That's not even a rebound anymore. It's like a cleared puck. Off the goalie and into the corner is a safe place. Denied that one. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Ovechkin. Sends the pass over. Edmonton's got the puck in the defensive end. The Oilers play it along the boards. And now he moves it to Carlson. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Up along the wing. Gaining speed through center and here they come on the attack. Milano's called for tripping, he's off to the box. unit is set. Well, James, statistically, we know that you score the first goal of the game, you're going to win well over 55% of the time. So that first goal is critical. Now you've got a great chance because you're on the power play. Slides the puck to Eller. Can't make it work. Quick feed to Gustafson. Centering feed. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. And that goes wide. Well, at least it sounded hard. I mean, the net's been in the same place for 200 years. That's a lot wide. Dowd's got it in the defensive end. And that pass doesn't go. And he takes the pass. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. The Capitals carry it along the wall. Edmonton's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Takes the feed. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. Here's a chance. And another stop. The Capitals have it against the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Dished on over to Gustafson. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Can't make the connection on the pass. He grabs the puck here at the point. And that's broken up. Hyman's got control of the puck in the corner. Handles the puck at the point. He's got a step. Oh, what a save by the keeper. He is locked in. He's so quick when he comes out to mirror the shooter. His reflexes allow him to wait, and he awaits the shooter here and then makes the save. McDavid's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Oh, she's won the draw. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Poked away at center by Brown. They put the puck into the offensive end. Milano's time is almost done. 
takes it to the front. Washington's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Quick pass to Oshi. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck now. Moves it quickly over to Horvat. Pass across to Jensen. Steps into the offensive end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Oshi. The Capitals take possession here in the open ice. Nice feed. Here's a pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Blast from the point. And that goes off course off a of body. Made the stop on the play. They are really feeling it now here in the Ozone. Oh, what a stop on the play. And the team's got it here. Puck picked up by Kuznetsov. Here we go. They've really ratcheted up the intensity here now in the Ozone. And they finally clear the zone. And here they go the other way. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. Puck scooped up by Bouchard. And now it's grabbed by Costin. Changes coming up on the back end as they send the puck in. Milano's got it along the boards. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Here we go, two on one. And that one's denied. Scooped up along the wall by Sheary. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Washington's across the blue line. And called for the offside, we'll get a face off. Getting into the later stages of this period. The game is still scoreless. The Capitals win it. Puck grabbed by Orlov. The Oilers move it ahead. Inside the final minute of the first here. Washington's got the puck in their own end. Looking to set up offensively. Here's a short pass to Horvath. Great defensive effort with the stick. The save. Shot from the block. Save made by the goalie. There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. Period number two seems ready to go. The teams are set. My broadcast partner, Ray Ferrar, was also set. Let's do this. Both teams still feeling each other out as we are scoreless here to start the second. Ray, we've already got 20 minutes under our belt here. What are your thoughts of this one so far? Not really an aggressive start. It's like no team wants to take a chance and open the game up yet. We'll see how this plays out in the next five or 10 minutes. The Oilers move the puck in the defensive zone. Pushes it across to Nurse. And he slides it quickly to Dreisaitl. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Washington's gained possession along the boards. Play rolls on. Moves it to Ovechkin. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Nurse. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Ovechkin. Quick feed to Dreisaitl. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Here he is, takes the shot! That's a textbook save by Campbell. No rebound there, you want the puck? Go we'll get it in the corner, the goalie's turned it aside. Pass broken up. There's a solid collision. Here they come on the attack. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Orlov's taking it from his own end. And now he tries to get it across to Carlson. Sits it in front, and that caroms off a twig in front of the net. Handles the puck. The Oilers will play it in their own end. Quick pass to Hyman. In close. Oh, what a save with 
with the stiff by Kemper. Moves it quickly over to Dow. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Poked away at center by Dow. Washington's looking to break out. Gains the zone from the right side. Battle along the wall. The Oilers gain possession. Slides it over to Horvat. Great use of the stick here at center ice. The Capitals gain possession in their own end. Feeds the puck over to Shiri. From the left side, takes it at center. Here's the pass. And that one stopped. The Oilers have played from the defensive zone. Horvath's crossed the line and gained the zone. Takes a shot. Can't connect on the play. Oh, man, you know, you want to play from in front, of course. I mean, the stats tell you, you score first, you win a majority of games. That's a great chance that doesn't test the goaltender. Trying to get the puck away from the inferno here. Hyman's got a great ability to hang in the play. Like that last one, James, he looked like after he stumbled, he was out of the play. Yet he gets himself back in position to get a pretty good chance on goal. Slick feed. Some solid defensive work in the road end with the poke check. Hanson the call there. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Looking for space inside the D zone. And he takes the feed. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Gustafson. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Taken along the wall by Brown. Here's a short pass to Eller. Poked away at center by Ryan. Oh, stopped with the pad by Campbell. costin has got the puck in his own zone. Second period nearly into its final minute here. And that goes off the iron and stays out. Hey, how about a bounce? Would you seriously, James? Call the goal sooner or later. This game doesn't have one, and that one goes off the goalpost. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Ellen. And there's the horn bringing an end to period number two. Still 20 minutes more of action in the third. Stick around. Welcome back, Jim Stavolsky ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. Still zeroes on the board here as we are underway in the third. Let's see if that changes. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. And now he angles it across to McDavid. The Oilers will play from the corner. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. by Campbell. Pinned up along the boards. Gives him a whack and the officials are going to call this one. Now a quick pass to McDavid. Centering pass! Scores! What a finish on the play! Edmonton's breathing a bit easier now here coming up with a big goal in this third period. Their bench was pretty excited when that goal went into the net. Now they'll want to continue to be aggressive and don't let your opponent start to dictate the pace. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Moves it to McDavid. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Fails to find the open man. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Bouchard's got it in the offensive zone. Still has possession. Washington's got the puck. The Capitals have it now. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Backstrom. And that's a great heads-up play by Puglia Yarby. 
the Oilers have really done a nice job without the puck. Good position, good stick position, as they steal the puck in a game that's not spreading out at all. Shot! Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Sharp reaction save. Horvath's picking up momentum through center. Washington's got control of it now from their own end. Oh, they had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Takes the feet at the back end. Quick feed to Van Riemsdyk. Receives the pass. Gustafson's got it along the wing. Skates to the crease. Campbell's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. The Oilers have taken a 1-0 lead. The Capitals win the faceoff. Here's a blast! Just wide! Not really close with that. He got lots on it, but nowhere near the net. Handles the puck from the left side. Drives to the paint! Yeah, after the teammate got hurt, he jumped right in. He's going to make him try and pay a price. We got ourselves a fight here. Score that as a point in Greco-Roman style there, Ray. Uh, I think what you got there, James, is two guys that are just tired of punching each other in the face. Ray, it looks like they're not done with each other down there. No, they're going to bark at each other on the way to the penalty box, but into the box they go. Time to sit down. Well, the crowd's right back into this one after a pretty spirited tilt just moments ago. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. The Oilers take it along the wall. And he regains control of the puck. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Picked up along the wall by Fogel. He carries the puck up along the wing. The Oilers aren't that far from a shutout. Hey, if you think they're superstition in it, too bad. They've got a shutout, and they're still going to do their best to protect it. Man, you don't get many chances like this. You work so hard to get into that great position. You've got to at least get it on the net. More than half the period has expired. Edmonton's up one zip. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Edmonton's moving it along the wing. Fires it into the offensive zone. Washington's got a hold of the puck. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. Quick pass to Backstrom. Big save. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. Poked away in the neutral zone by Carlson. Nice feed from the left side up the middle. Washington's got the puck along the boards. Moves it over to Ovechkin. The Capitals looking against the half wall. Oh, he lunges with comes up huge with the poke check. Huge gamble pays off. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Backstrom. Point shot. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. There's another stop. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Poked away at center by Costin. Oh, here we go. This team knows how to turn it up another gear, and they have done that here. Another shot! Oh, and another big save! And a huge break for the D as the puck leaves the zone. Taken by Carlson. Passes up ahead from the left wing. Moves it quickly over to Nugent Hopkins. Puck exits the zone. Picked up along the boards by Milano. Puck picked up by Nugent Hopkins. The Capitals have it on the offensive end. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Pucks it away in his own end. Stayed by the goaltender who stayed with it on the redirect. Sends one up to Shiri. 
Moves into the middle. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Here he is with the backhander. Scores! Oh, there it is, Jake. E eventually, if you give up chances, you're going to give one up. But I thought it was too late. Yet they find a way to level the game off. No, he's been impressive tonight anyway, James. I mean, it stinks that you get this far into the game and the shutout is gone. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Oilers win the draw here in the neutral zone. And now it's over to Pugliarvi. Into the third period, we are still tied, and that means overtime is looming in moments. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabolski here in the broadcast booth. They are ready to drop the puck on OT. Oh, the anticipation ramping up in this barn. You can just feel it right now. Moment of truth for both sides. Sudden death over time. Let's get it on. Slides it across to Ovechkin. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And makes the routine save. And that's a great heads-up play in the offensive zone. Quick pass to Nugent Hopkins. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. The Capitals look to start the transition game. And that pass is redirected. That pass doesn't go. Puck scooped up by Backstrom. The Oilers take possession in the defensive end. And now it's grabbed by Orlov. Washington's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Ovechkin it against the boards. Game on a stick, and he denies him with a monstrous save here in overtime. And they keep the pressure on. The Capitals ready to go on the attack. Slides it across to Hyman. Knocked away with the stick by Oshie. Washington's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Great reach by Oshie. Here's a chance. Scores! What an OT winner! A tenacious effort, and they get rewarded with the OT victory. Pretty clear the goaltender's not expecting this shot. That defensive zone turnover results in this quick shot. Keeps the goalie low. What a night. You gotta love the intensity of the playoffs, and we will see you down the road at the next game. It's playoff time, baby. Good night from all of us here at EA Sports.